Mike Chaplin is a member of the Royal Watercolour Society and a fellow of the Royal Society of Arts and is recognised as one of the leading watercolour artists of his generation. His love of teaching and his enthusiasm for painting earned him the role of resident art expert in more than 60 episodes of the much-loved TV programme Watercolour Challenge. Mike's work shows a master of the watercolour medium in action. His paintings have a sense of light and space that only watercolour can truly give. For this film, Mike travelled to the coastal resort of Southwold on the Suffolk coast to give us an insight into how he tackles the challenge of watercolour. If you take time as you walk around through potential subject matter to squint your eyes right down, you'll find in fact that we live in quite a mid-toned world within which, as here, light and dark things happen. Now I can't resist this anymore, I've really got to start laying in the geometry of this jetty. And I like this hard geometry, the way that comes really bang in the middle of that shape there and then picks up in an optimistic way and carries on its journey across to that jetty. This is good, strong stuff, and how quickly that composition starts to assert itself. There's a really strident cadmium red bit of a, I think it's on the side of a, a life belt thing over that side. That almost completes the eye's passage round within what is just a picture of a hut, basically. It is also a picture of a composition. The passage for the eye as it runs and encounters all these different reds as we come round. And they're up here as well. I mean, once we put those in and start getting some really real strength into this composition. OK, we've covered all the paper. We've isolated that one little bit of clean paper, which, funnily enough, it's the one bit of paper we haven't painted on, which is the point of the whole painting, really, rather bizarrely. So now what I'm doing is sort of putting some little dabs of colour just to make it an interesting passage from the eye. We'll put some colour in, which I'm going to echo in the sea down here. Quite decorative, quite sort of fluid, fluid strokes. There's no reason why painting always has to be completely about explaining everything. I think it's sometimes quite good to give yourself permission just to paint in quite a decorative, fluid sort of way. 